We'll do a couple of versions of problem 14 from 2.6 in my open math. Right, the first question, a rental car offers two plans for renting a car. Plan A is $25 per day and 20 cents per mile. Plan B is $40 per day and seven cents per mile. For what range of miles will plan B save you money? So you want plan B to be less than plan A. The piece we don't know is how many miles they drive. So that will be our variable. We'll let X equal the number of miles. And then we need an expression for each plan. So plan A, sorry about that. Uh, plan A, $25 per day. So that's a fixed cost per day plus, and that's in dollars. So we need to put this notation for 20 cents, it has to be in the same form. So it needs to be 0 0.20 per mile. So this would be times your number of miles. And plan B will be $40 a day plus 7 cents, so 0 0.07 times the number of miles. So we want B to be um, better by, so it's going to save us money. So it needs to be less than plan A. And if you wrote it the other way with this one in front, then your symbol would go the other direction. All right, so let's solve. Um, for inequalities, I like to keep the X on the left. So I'm going to get rid of this 0 0.20 X. Um, also, before I do that, if you choose to clear the decimals, you certainly could. You would have to multiply through by 100. And that just makes these numbers get a little large. Since we have a calculator, I will bypass that and just use the calculator. So I'm going to get rid of 0 0.20 X so that I'm keeping my X on the left. And just do that in your calculator or in your head. It's going to give us negative 0.13 X. And then we're going to isolate the X. So we are going to get rid of the 40. It's positive, so we have to take it away. So we have negative 0.13x is less than, and this will be a negative 15. And then we have one more step. We have to <clears throat> divide by the coefficient of x. It is negative, so it's going to make our inequality symbol flip. So negative 0.13. This is going to flip. So x is greater than. Your two negatives here will give you positive, And we'll punch that in the calculator. Negative 15 divided by negative 0.13. You're dividing by something very small, so you're going to get a much bigger number. So I get 115.38. Right? And you want to make sure here that you follow the directions. It says round your answer to the nearest mile, right? Your mile is going to be your whole number. And so you look one digit to the right, just one. So a three is not enough to push it up. So you're going to drop those off and you will answer X is greater than 115 miles. 
So if they only drove 40 miles, um, plan A is better. Let's look at one more version of this problem. And I didn't write it down for you on the um, screen, but we can just pull it over. So a car rental company offers two plans for renting a car. Plan A is $30 per day and 17 cents per mile. And plan B is $50 per day and three cents per mile. For what range of plans will B save you money? So we want B to be smaller than A. So we'll get our expressions. So A is going to be $30 plus 17 cents. So switch that to dollar form, which would be 0.17. And we'll let X equal the number of miles. So this is times the number of miles. Plan B will be $50 plus 3 cents per mile. So 0 0.03 times X. And we want B to be less than A. So 50 plus 0 0.03 X is less than 30 plus 0 0.03. 17x. Get rid of your x term, and I'm going to keep my x on the left. Um, I like to do that with inequalities, so we'll get rid of the 17.17x. And so we'll have left 50, and this will be negative 4.14x is less than 30. Now get rid of your 50, and so we'll subtract a 50 from both sides. You have negative 0.14x is less than negative 20, and we're going to divide by negative 0.14. So this goes out. So x, remember when you divide by a negative? Your symbol is going to flip. Your two negatives here will give you positive. And I'm just going to pull the calculator over real fast. And we'll divide negative 20 divided by negative 0.14. Make sure you're using the negative not the subtract. And that gives me 142.85. And that's far enough. The um, directions say round the solution to the nearest mile. Right? Your mile is your whole number. So you look to the right. This time, the 8 is going to push it up. So we're going to have x is greater than 143 miles. So more than 143 miles, plan B will be a better deal.